What's up everybody? Welcome to Roaming Elsewhere. I hope you guys are doing absolutely great. So we have come to the most beautiful hill station of Kerala, Munnar. So Munnar is famous for its lush green tea estates, flora and fauna, its lakes and so much more. So today we are going to explore that. So we are at Lokha Tea Estates which is one of the famous tea estates here and I cannot wait to get into these tea estates and among the greenery of this place. So why to wait? Let's just go! So this is my first time in Munnar even though I have come to Kerala twice before but Munnar is the first time so I am really really very excited. I am going to run into these fields. Sorry if I look like an excited kid in the park but I am so happy I am finally in Munnar. been dying to see tea estates. So the tea estates are looking so beautiful. I mean, can't express how beautiful this place is. Some of these tea farms are cloud laden at this moment, but it still is looking so beautiful, so out of the world. just can't take my eyes off this view, it's so mesmerizing. So Amitoj, how did you like Munar Tea Estates? Amazing. I mean, we were waiting for so many times this tea plantation in the road. And the way it started, it doesn't have the name of it. It's very beautiful. And the best thing is that there is a lot of rush here. It's very peaceful. It's fun. पहली बार आया हूँ और इट्स लाइक कि मैं बता नहीं पा रहा हूँ कितना अच्छा लग रहा है एंड हाँ थोड़ा अभी थोड़ा मिस्टी सा है बट स्टिल वो एक अलग इफेक्ट डाल रहा है और काफी बढ़िया व्यू है And then of course, we had to interact with women who worked in those tea estates. Vanakkam. Vanakkam. Kaise ho? Hindi? Hindi yalla deriyadi. Malayalam nahi? Malayalam nahi, English nahi, Hindi nahi. Only Tamil. You look beautiful auntie, sundar. Beautiful. Many of these women were indigenous Adivasi women who relocated here centuries ago during British rule. More than 500 women work in Lokha tea estates and the estate's owner prefer women when it comes to plucking tea leaves because of their reliability. Watching these women doing everyday chores with this stunning backdrop of tea estates was quite honestly therapeutic. You want to work here, Ratna? I just want to be here. I can't take my eyes off this view. It's so beautiful. Like you want to see this again and again. You don't feel like going back. Of course, I didn't work in the tea estates, but I certainly enjoyed my experience of living their life in these lovely tea gardens just for a little while. So I'm going to get click pictures in this costume. I'm going to show you how they're looking. So 
सो वी हैव नाउ कम टू लोखा टी फैक्ट्री दिस इज़ वन ऑफ द ओल्डेस्ट टी फैक्ट्रीज हियर एंड वी लर्न अबाउट टी मेकिंग हियर लेट्स कम आई कैन ऑलरेडी स्मेल लॉर्ड ऑफ टी फ्लेवर्स हियर So just got to know that this factory has a living legacy of 150 years, and it's located in a very peaceful location. The surrounding is very beautiful. You will come and enjoy the silence here. The location of the factory is Lockhart Tea Factory, but the name of the factory is Harrison Malayalam Factory, and the older name of the factory is Harrison Rosefield Factory. Alright, so we came a little ahead of time. So, but we were thinking, how are we going to pass time? But the surroundings of this place will take care of that, right? We still having good time. It has a garden in front of it, and the better views are there. Like yeah. if you come across the garden, there are great views out there, so you can enjoy your time. I to suggest that come a little early. Sit here, chill, and then go and have a tour. Yeah, it's so peaceful. This place is so well maintained. Time to go in. And the process of tea production starts right at the factory door, where you see huge piles of tea leaves being brought from the tea estates and unloaded directly on the dumb waiter lift. to start the tea production we were loving the wooden interior and rustic charm of the olden days in the factory it sort of took us back in time factory tour lasted for about 30 to 40 minutes where they took us through the short and simple process of tea production and the tour concludes with a tea tasting session Purchase some tea for you, for yeah, yourself. Yeah, some premium quality tea that we all should be drinking. So basically, very informative session. Absolutely, I recommend this place, especially if you are a tea lover. Yeah, don't think that it's uh, it's going to be boring. No, it's yeah. it won't be. It's a simple process. It's interesting. You will enjoy the tour. So do come here. Do not miss out. And they will teach you right way of drinking tea. Which yes. I think most Indians need to need learn. Need to learn, yeah. So, all right, guys. It's three thirty in the morning, and we are going to Kolukumlai to see the sunrise, the famous sunrise in Manar. It's going to take us forty-five kilometers to reach there, and we are going to do that in the jeep. Some of this journey would be. Off road, complete off road. Gaurav, are you ready for an adventure? Let's see how it is. <laughs> and it was the most audacious and adventurous experience of the whole trip. However, it was all worth it because what we saw next was otherworldly. So the sun has finally risen. This is like really out of the world. Can't even express 
the magnificent view that I can witness right now. Yeah. I'm so thankful that I could witness it. How's it, guys? I mean, we are so lucky that the weather was clean today. We got a very good sunset. Mila. It is worth coming from these bad roads, but completely worth. ये ट्रिप की हाईलाइट थी मतलब जो मैं देख पा रहा हूँ आई कैन नॉट टेल यू के इट्स इट्स सो अमेजिंग आई कैन नॉट एक्सप्रेस इन वर्ड्स एंड कैमरा से जस्टिस नहीं हो पाएगा जो आप नेकेड आई से देख रहे हैं कोलुकुमलाइ सनराइज हैंड्स डाउन टॉप्स माई लिस्ट ऑफ थिंग्स टू डू इन मुनार सो प्लीज डू नॉट मिस आउट ऑन दिस वन So let me talk about the adventurous ride we had had in the morning. I haven't had such an adventurous ride in, in my entire life. The ride was topsy turvy, up and down, here left, right, center. So it's not for the faint heart. You can see the entire eight kilometer patch is like this. This guy was driving, and he was driving the fastest. He was overtaking everybody. So. <laughs> अगर आपने पूरा मजा लेना है तो पीछे बैठ जाओ गाड़ी के वो बहुत आई वुड सजेस्ट जस्ट सिट इन द सेंटर और इन द फ्रंट मतलब हां अगर आपको थोड़ा कम झटके खाने हैं तो थोड़ा सेंटर में बैठो अदरवाइज अगर आपको फुल मजे लेने हैं व्हिच तो वी हैड हाउ वाज इट फॉर यू गॉड शुरुआत में तो शॉक लगा आई नो मतलब ऐसा लगता है कि अभी गिरने वाले हैं बट जो कंट्रोल है नंगा गाड़ी पर हां वो अमेजिंग है एक बार आदत हो गई फिर मजा आने लगता है Yeah, in the end when you start to enjoy, yeah. Do you agree? Every bone of your body shakes like. True. पेट में जो भी था सब इधर उधर हो गया. शुक्र है कुछ खाया नहीं इधर. आप बताओ क्या मजा आ रहा है? ज़्यादा मजा आ रहा है. बताओ जान निकल रही है. Like eight kilometer is like that only. भाई गाड़ी के टायर वगैरह काफी मेंटेनेंस करनी पड़ती होगी ना? हाँ मेंटेनेंस. So on the way back, you can witness the Kulumalai tea estates. These are the world's highest tea estates, and uh, look at this view, man! So beautiful. So today we are going to the top station one of the most popular destinations in Munnar and on the way we are going to cover Mattupatti Dam Echo Point and Kadala Lake Let's go The way to the top station is full of stunning views the whole journey acquaints you with the enchanting charm of Munnar tea estates Also came across one of the famous Mattupatti tea estates. And then we took a short halt at Mattupatti Dam, which was quintessentially quaint and scenic. There is also a boating facility at Mattupatti Lake which you can certainly try if you have the time. <laughs> so 
so we have come to echo point um i was not sure if the voice your sound actually echoes but it actually does i've just heard one of the uncles doing it i'll show you ha echo 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 <laughs> Amito, you want to scream at the I'm, top of your lungs? I'm feeling a little conscious doing that, but I'm fine. Okay. First of all, this place is very calm and peaceful. If you, मतलब shout or scream at the top of your lungs, it's definitely going to echo. Let's try that. Perfect. Yeah. So it's so much fun do not miss out on this place you're going to love it and it's so much fun you're going to have fun So almost every place in Munar is a view point like you just feel like taking out your camera every now and then and just shoot because it's so beautiful This is not a viewpoint or something, but just see. Can you hear bird tweeting? I am in awe of this place. On the way to the top station we also came across Kundala Dam which is known for its serene ambience. and it's a favored spot for tourists seeking tranquility amidst nature so kundla dam has a kundla lake uh, where you can opt to boat so you can take your boat from here and uh, cruise the kundla lake i think it's going to be a great experience we are going to skip because we have to go to the top station as we are nearing top station and going higher and higher we find ourselves amidst misty and cloud laden mountains so we have reached top station throughout the way it's, it was all cloudy and misty but very beautiful we couldn't see so many views but whatever we could see among the clouds and the mist was so beautiful i don't think we are going to witness any view today because it's very misty and cloudy but the feel of this place i can't explain it's so nice the weather is so pleasant so we are going to walk further for 5 minutes to reach the top station let's see what we are going to see So we have reached top station. That's the point where, which is the highest point. But uh, there is hardly any view. We are still going to go. So we are at Alapatti Tea Estates. Um, nobody told us to visit here. It's the random place we stopped, and uh, it's one of the most beautiful uh, views that I have seen. So we just stopped and thought we'll capture this place. Wow. 
வணக்கம் love the fact that these women working in the tea estates invited us to their home but unfortunately we couldn't go because it was our last day in munar and we had to leave with a luggage full of wonderful memories <laughs> bye i think no one can show you full munar vlog i mean all the vlogs you see on uh, youtube including ours will not do justice you have to come here you will discover your own beautiful spots I think Munar has a lot to offer.